Hey friends, good morning. Happy Monday. It is the start of a new vlog and I'm still in Salt Lake City with Aya. We just stopped at a gas station. I got a cookie, which I'm about to eat, and we're going to the Salt Flats today. So I'm so excited for that. Okay, this is a Salt Lake City brand and I just broke it, but it's called Sugar Fix and it looks really cute. It looks pretty yum. It's a nice size. Mm. Size. I think like the chocolate's pretty um, like milky and it's like got like a crumbly cookie flavor which is good it's not super buttery mm. I think it was like two dollars fifty cents does it make you think of Utah in any way um, well it's a tiny bit dry <laughs> Would, definitely would come back for another one. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, what's not to love? It's good. Hmm. I'm gonna give it like a 7.5. That's what I was gonna say based really? on your reaction. It's not like, I'm not freaking out, but I'm also not hating it. Like I'd probably, if there was like another one to eat right now, I would have another one, so that's pretty high rating. Cool. But it's a little bit crumbly for me. Like I would rather it be like a tiny bit gooier. Okay. Yeah. Seven point five. Let's go to Salt Flats. Woo! We've been driving around for a while just exploring. Out here we're gonna take some reels and video and also shooting some Sojourn content. Look at this. Okay, these are the leggings, which you actually haven't even seen on the vlog yet, really, but here they are, the field trip blanket, in the middle of nowhere. Oh, wow. This is crazy. It looks so good. We've been out here trying to shoot and then it was raining! So we kind of took a break for a bit. And now it is like pretty nice out again. So we're gonna shoot some stuff before it starts raining again. We are the only ones out here right now. It like got super rainy and then it's not raining, so we are the only ones out here. It's absolutely insane. It's so cool. It's like the coolest place I feel like I've been to. It feels like we're on another planet. It's insane. There's my blanket. The blue sky is coming out. It's like, it's so gorgeous. It's, I can't, I can't. It's so fun. I just being such a great photographer. She's a model, she's a model and she's a photographer. She's we'll awesome. see how the photos turn out. <laughs>
That was such a great shoot. We had such a good time. So fun. So fun. Oh, I'm actually flying back to Vancouver tonight. tonight in a couple hours. I'm so glad that we came. And like the weather worked out for us. Yeah, it was awesome. <laughs> Hi, Salt Flats. I also have to tell you guys, I was just getting changed out of my Sojourn <laughs> leggings and... No, let me tell it. I was just waiting for her to get changed. And all of a sudden I hear a scream and I look at my rear view mirror and I just see her butt cheeks like waddling over. <laughs> and then I look out my window and she's chasing a shirt that's getting blown away. It was my pants. With her pants half down. <laughs> that was a good way to end the shoot. Just a little bit of bare bum, bare bum action. <laughs> Glasses look cute on you. Your glasses, your pants, your shirt. What the heck? <laughs> Look who showed up to pick me up at the airport with flowers. You're the best boyfriend ever. I missed you. <laughs> We're out for a walk. Oh my gosh, I can't even lift my head, my hand up tall enough to get you in it. Beautiful day in the neighborhood. Wow, what's this? Oh, Ruxton. Pretty nice. Looks it's like green. he's have, uh, pipe, wrapped pipes and then changed his mind. Looks like he also dropped it. That's okay. And what can you tell us? Oh, it's supposed to be fast. Probably isn't. <laughs> What are you gonna get? I don't know. We got ice cream again. Mine is chocolate brownie fudge something. Aaron got two scoops. I think I got uh, fudge, vanilla fudge brownie and chocolate peanut butter Oreo. Mmm. Oh my god. This is so good. Mm-hmm. Okay, so this place is famous because they have 283 flavors inside. And I love it because it has a pink wall, so obviously, so cute. We were here like two vlogs ago, weren't we? Yeah, the, um, the motorcycle meetup was right here. But we came back because we were so busy chatting to everyone on that uh, meetup day that we didn't actually get any ice cream. Hey guys, good morning. Um, oh, I feel like there's something on the lens. I'm not gonna touch it. Um, good morning. It is Friday of the week that I got back from. <laughs> oh no. Um, it's been a week. It's been a week. It's been a week of getting back into routine. I've been exhausted. Some of the girls from the trip got. Wow, this looks so cool. Some of the girls from the trip got sick. I haven't gotten sick yet, but I've been very tired. Um, and so I have a photo shoot today I just did, and I have a wedding I'm shooting tomorrow which is gonna be very fun. But I was just sitting here um, replying to and like working on some Sojourn Instagram stuff because I haven't been posting or started posting on my social media. Like I haven't started the Instagram account essentially and basically I need to. And so today I just decided I'm just gonna post a reel that I made in the Salt Flats with Aya. Like I just need to start, you know, I'm just kind of like afraid of starting and just cause I know that once I start, I just really can't stop. So cross my fingers, it goes okay. I haven't really like made a plan yet. I have like 
kind of my plan for my social media, but I just don't have the, like, everything laid out. And then I was just answering a bunch of questions on, on Bren Louise, I've been posting my Instagram account. I've been posting about Sojourn, and then basically whenever people, like, ask questions about Sojourn, I, Bren Louise, reply as Sojourn, because it's all me, <laughs> it's like, Sojourn's responding to these people's comments just so that people get used to like seeing the account name and like, you know, the account starts getting like used, but it's still me. It's just so funny to me. What happens when you're like a one person business? <laughs> so I just thought I would actually like answer some of the questions on here because I feel like why not? Someone said, when can we order? So I am planning for Sojourn launch. I was really honestly hoping for it to be like July 1st, but realistically it's not gonna be, I think, until July 16th. I think I could be ready to launch July 1st, but it would be so hectic and not enough time to like post on social media for two weeks and get like really excited about it. So I'm, that's just what I'm planning for. Someone asked, do they have D3O protection in the leggings or any kind of armor? Thanks. So they are gonna have Sastec level two armor. It's really flexible. Um, of course, I'll make a YouTube video all about the leggings when I first launch them. But yeah, they're coming with knee armor and then you can buy the hip armor separately. And they are fully paramarid, so Kevlar, but it's like a, it's called paramarid fiber line. So the whole legging is lined. Um, in this material so that you have full um, abrasion resistance and protection. Someone said, are they leather or are they PU? So they mean like polyurethane leather and will you be shipping to the UK? So they are vegan leather, so they are technically PU leather. Real leather just doesn't really have the same sort of stretch, stretch retention. And I really honestly just wanted to go after that kind of like fake leather legging look. People want like real, like fake leather to look like real leather, but you don't want it to look like real leather on your butt. Like I just think that the real leather pants and like Motorcycle pants, they don't look good on your butt because it's saggy and leather doesn't really stretch so it gets like this diaper. I don't know, my whole opinion about it was like, I actually wanna make like a fake leather legging because girls wear those to ride in, which is crazy because it has no protection. So I just wanted to offer like, you know, a little bit more protection than just your no normal fake leather leggings. And I will be shipping internationally. You know, you'll have to pay duties. Um, obviously, if you live in Canada or the USA, things are gonna be a little bit cheaper for you to like get um, in terms of shipping. But as a small business right now, I cannot afford to um, like cover the cost of shipping. So hopefully you guys still wanna support me even though shipping probably will be expensive. So those are the ones that I just had right there. So I'm gonna today work on some social media stuff, try and get the website going even more than I have. Uh, just like a bunch of computer stuff that I have not been able to do this week while I've been working because I came back and just got right back into my other job. So anyways, yeah, very exciting week, day. Everything is coming in its own time. I'm trusting the timing of everything that happens. Um, all my product is on its way. So it's just really the final countdown, just like getting everything together, which is like kind of easier said than done. So I actually am going in, going to a baseball game today. So I guess we'll see you there. <laughs> Okay, so we just had the baseball game, and honestly, we don't like baseball, but it was <laughs> fun to go. We went with Aaron's work, which was really nice, and we we're super. Involved. It is a Honda. Okay, so I don't know about you guys, but Aaron and I play a game of like, what bike is that? All the time, whenever we're out, and we're like, what bike is that? What bike is that? What and then, the heck, is it? And then we get close enough to see it, and I saw this bike from far away. Okay, oh, see this me? is not common. Uh, okay. Like, you, know, you never see. <laughs> okay, wait, guys. I said it's a Honda, and then Aaron didn't really guess. You said it was a Versus? Yeah. And anyways, Kate, look at this. It's a Honda uh, CBF 1000. What do you think? Cool. I mean, I don't know much about it, but it looks pretty dope, and it's 1000, so it's got a, got a good a little bit of kick to it. Yeah. <laughs> so anyways, we did that. And What's that? What is it? that? Oh, <laughs> Shiny one. 
We started eating it and I forgot to videotape it. I actually did videotape it. Do you like it? <laughs> Does she like it? You can't put that on the internet. So, oh my god, I just uh, went into JJ Bean. You know, the one that I have been to before to do my cookie review. And the barista was so nice. She loved my jumpsuit, which I just got from Ritzia. It's actually adorable. She got this cookie for free. <laughs> This is like the best cookie ever. So pretty. Look, the rainbow leads to the golden arches. It's actually like way prettier in person. What the heck? We're just having the craziest night here. So pretty. Hey guys, I just got home from the longest day ever, the longest Saturday, which I've vlogged quite a bit today. And I came home to this package. Um, Outside my door, and I think it's packaging. It's probably Mailer's own tag! Oh my gosh, fun! Oh, they're huge! Fun! This is so cute! Oh my gosh. That looks so good! That's so cute! These, this is what's gonna have stickers and small items in it. Oh my gosh, cute! That's, That's gonna have dope. like a toque. Yeah, so the shipping label can go in the back and it's gonna have like a little toque or like some stickers. What? Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh wow. This is crazy, all this stuff is like so real. Surreal. Cereal. It's like translucent. It's just it's like backwards right now. But the sojourn, sojourn, sojourn on it. Looks really cute. This is crazy. The poly bags especially are pretty crazy and they're recyclable. The tissue is really cute too. It's gonna look all really good all together. I can't wait to like bring it to the studio and like pretend to act in order. Hey guys, I just wanted to pop on here and say good night, goodbye. It is Sunday night and I am in this studio, I've been doing some work, and I am exhausted. It's been a bit of a hard day. Um, just some things went wrong with some, like, product coming in. Maybe I'll tell you about it tomorrow. Um, yeah, it was Father's Day today, which was really nice, and we went to see the Gra Jurassic Park movie, so that was really fun. Um, but, yeah, just, I mean, obviously, generally, just feeling a little haggard and exhausted and I'm about to go to bed. So thanks for coming with me this week. Um, yeah, we only have a couple more weeks to launch. Seems like there's everything to be done still. So yeah, I guess we'll just get to it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for coming. Um, hope you stick around and like and subscribe.